Let's break down what a crypto wallet really is. It's a fundamental tool in the cryptocurrency world, and understanding its function is crucial for anyone looking to engage with digital currencies. We'll explore its core purpose and how it differs from traditional wallets. It's definitely not a pouch for digital coins like this. Forget the image of a leather wallet stuffed with cash. Instead, it primarily stores the private keys. These keys are the heart of your crypto ownership. These private keys are what prove you own crypto on the blockchain. They're your digital signature, allowing you to authorize transactions. Think of the blockchain as a public ledger, a transparent and immutable record of all transactions. Every crypto transaction is recorded on this ledger, and your wallet as the key ring that unlocks your assets on that ledger. It's the tool that allows you to interact with the blockchain and manage your crypto holdings. Your wallet doesn't actually hold coins in a physical sense, but it holds the secret codes, those private keys, that let you access and spend them. These codes are essential for proving ownership and authorizing transactions. Without your wallet and its keys, specifically your private keys, your crypto is locked away, completely inaccessible. It's like having a safety deposit box with no key. A crypto wallet can take many forms. It can be an app on your smartphone offering convenient access to your crypto, or a program installed on your computer providing a more desktop-oriented experience, or even a physical device often called a hardware wallet, offering enhanced security. Ultimately, it's your command center for sending, receiving, cryptocurrency, and managing all of your digital assets in one place. Crucially, it generates and stores your private and public keys, the foundation of your crypto security. And it lets you interact with the blockchain securely, ensuring your transactions are protected. In short, your wallet is your gateway to the world of crypto, enabling you to participate in this exciting digital landscape. Every wallet has two keys, a public key and a private key. Your public key is like your bank account number, safe to share so people can send you crypto. You can generate multiple public addresses for privacy, but all are linked to your wallet. Your private key is your master password, never share it. Anyone with your private key can take your funds, and there's no undo button. When you send crypto, your wallet uses your private key to sign the transaction. The network verifies your signature using your public key without ever seeing your private key. This cryptography keeps your funds secure. Remember, not your keys, not your coins. Where do you keep your keys? Your house keys, your car keys? These physical keys unlock access to your tangible assets. But what about your digital assets? How do you secure the keys to your crypto kingdom? There are hot wallets and cold wallets. These are the two primary methods for storing your cryptocurrency each with its own set of advantages and disadvantages. Understanding the difference is crucial for responsible crypto ownership. Hot wallets are apps or programs connected to the internet. Think of them as your everyday digital wallet, easily accessible on your phone or computer. They're great for quick everyday transactions. Buying a coffee with crypto, splitting a bill with friends. A hot wallet makes it simple. They're convenient but more vulnerable to hacks and malware. Because they're constantly connected, they're exposed to potential threats lurking online. Cold wallets, like hardware devices, store your keys offline. They are not constantly connected to the internet, significantly reducing the risk of unauthorized access. They're the safest option for long-term storage, immune to online attacks. Your private keys are essentially locked away in a digital vault. To use a cold wallet, you connect it briefly to sign transactions, but your private key never leaves the device. This adds an extra layer of security, ensuring that even if your computer is compromised, your crypto remains safe. Most people use both, a hot wallet for spending, a cold wallet for savings. It's about finding the right balance between accessibility and security. Think of hot wallets as your cash on hand and cold wallets as your vault. Balance convenience and security for your needs. Assess your risk tolerance and the amount of crypto you're holding to determine the best strategy for you. Ready to dive in and start using your crypto wallet? It might seem a little daunting at first, but don't worry. We're here to guide you through the process. We'll break down the steps involved in sending and receiving cryptocurrency, making it easy to understand, even if you're a complete beginner. Here's a step-by-step -step guide on how to receive and send crypto using your digital wallet. We'll cover everything from locating your public address to confirming the transaction on the blockchain. To receive crypto, the first step is to open your wallet application on your smartphone or computer. Make sure you have the latest version installed for optimal security and performance. Once open, select the specific cryptocurrency you want to receive, 
such as Bitcoin or Ethereum. Then, find your public address or QR code associated with that coin. This is what you'll share with the sender. Share your public address or QR code with the person who will be sending you the crypto. You can copy and paste the address or allow them to scan the QR code directly from your screen. After the sender initiates the transaction, it needs to be confirmed on the blockchain. This process can take a few minutes or sometimes longer, depending on the network congestion. Once the transaction is confirmed, your wallet balance will automatically update to reflect the received crypto. Now let's look at sending crypto. To send crypto, you'll first need to obtain the recipient's public address. This is a crucial step, so double-check that you have the correct address before proceeding. Open your wallet application and locate the Send or Withdraw button. This will typically be found on the main screen or within the specific cryptocurrency section. Tap it to initiate the sending process. Carefully enter the recipient's public address into the designated field. Then, specify the amount of crypto you wish to send. Be mindful of any minimum or maximum sending limits imposed by your wallet or exchange. Before finalizing the transaction, take a moment to double-check all the details. Verify that the recipient's address is correct, the amount is accurate, and you understand any associated fees. Once you're confident that everything is in order, confirm the transaction. Keep in mind that you'll typically need to pay a small network fee to process the transaction. This fee compensates the miners or validators who maintain the blockchain network. The fee amount can vary depending on network congestion and the speed at which you want the transaction to be confirmed. If you're using a cold wallet, which is a hardware device that stores your crypto offline for added security, you'll need to connect it to your computer or mobile device. After reviewing the transaction details on your cold wallet screen, you'll need to physically approve the transaction by pressing a button on the device. This adds an extra layer of security, ensuring that only you can authorize the transfer of your crypto. Once you've confirmed the transaction, your wallet broadcasts it to the blockchain network. This initiates the process of verifying and adding the transaction to the distributed ledger. And that's it. Your crypto is now on its way to the recipient. The time it takes for the transaction to be fully confirmed can vary, but you can usually track its progress using a blockchain explorer. As a final reminder, always double and triple check the recipient's address and the amount you're sending before confirming any transaction. Cryptocurrency transactions are irreversible, so it's essential to be extra cautious to avoid any costly mistakes. In crypto, you're your own bank, there's no customer service if you lose your keys, lose your private key, and your funds are gone forever. That's why wallets give you a seed phrase, a list of words that can restore your wallet if your device is lost or broken. Write your seed phrase on paper and store it safely, never digitally. Never share your seed phrase or private key with anyone, ever. No legitimate service will ask for them. Be wary of phishing scams and fake websites. Protecting your keys and seed phrase is your top security priority. Take these steps, and you control your crypto destiny. Crypto wallets are just tools for managing your keys and accessing the blockchain. Start small, buy a little crypto and practice sending it between wallets. Get comfortable with addresses, transactions, and security basics. When you're ready, invest in a hardware wallet for peace of mind. Remember, not your keys, not your coins. Self-custody is true crypto ownership. Double-check every address before sending funds. Be skeptical of offers that sound too good to be true. Guard your seed phrase as if your financial future depends on it. Stay curious, stay safe, and keep learning. Welcome to the future of finance you're in control.